Welcome Brainers! If you're a Windows user, you've probably faced these frustrating C drive out of space errors from time to time. Even when you thoroughly clean up your PC, these errors tend to habitually reoccur after a few months. In this video we'll show you simple and highly effective techniques to give your C drive the cleanup it deserves. Without further ado, let's dive right in. Step 1. Identify and uninstall unnecessary large apps. Please search and open installed apps. Once you're here, the most important thing to do is to ensure that the sorting order is set to size, large to small. Now, please uninstall the apps one by one that are not needed or are rarely used. I would recommend going through this check and uninstallation process for all the apps that occupy more than 100 megabytes of space. Step 2. Discover and delete monster files that are not needed. Randomly deleting files won't benefit much, so we're going to use a free and reliable utility that can help us locate the largest files that are eating most of your space. Please download and install Windows Directory Statistics using the link provided in the description. Once the application is installed, launch it. Select the drive, in our case, it's the C drive. Wait for the scan to complete. After the scan is complete, you'll be presented with a visual map that simplifies the process of locating the large files. Please remember that you cannot directly delete files like pagefile.sys, hyperfill.sys, or swapfile.sys. If these files are consuming a significant amount of space on your system, please refer to the link provided in the description for specific guidance to safely delete or resize them. If you want to remove files associated with programs, please refer back to step 1 and uninstall the corresponding program. As for other large files like videos and movies, you can delete them directly as I do. Step 3. Run Windows Disk Cleanup. Please search for and open Disk Cleanup. Select the drive you want to clean up. In our case, it's the C drive. Choose Clean Up System Files. This will initiate another scan. These are mostly unwanted temporary files or files in the download folders. To be more specific, this action will not delete your personal files or programs. You can select everything that's applicable unless you want to exclude something specifically. When you're ready, click OK. In addition, as part of disk cleanup you can also delete old system restore points. To do this, please return to the same screen and select Clean Up System Files once again. This time, head to More Options and click on Clean Up under System Restore. This action will remove all old system restore points except the most recent one. Tap on Delete, and then OK. Usually, your recycle bin gets emptied as part of the disk cleanup we've just done. However, if it's not empty, make sure to empty the recycle bin, otherwise, you won't fully get the benefits of the cleanups we've just completed. Furthermore, you can in fact consider borrowing space from nearby drives. For more details on this, please refer to the video link provided in the description. I hope this is helpful. Please do like the video and subscribe to our channel. If you've any questions or thoughts, please feel free to leave them in the comments section below. Thanks for watching.